Hey everyone, welcome back to Sebrof. In this video, I will be explaining that how to fix Discord soundboard not showing up in your Discord server and how to use Discord soundboard on Discord server. So make sure that you watch the video till the end and I'm very sure that by the end of this video, you'll find the solution. Now, just keep in mind that Discord soundboard is only available for the server that has less than 50 members. All right, let me show you. This is my Discord server. Okay, and this server has more than 500 members, I guess. So let me go to uh, Discord server settings, then go to members. And you can see it's around 613 members over here. Okay, so what happens if I go and connect to any of the voice channel? You can see that I don't get the option of soundboard. All right, you can, you can see that I'm not getting any kind of soundboard icon over here. All right. And now let me go to a different discord server that is that has less than 50 members on the same discord application so let me open it okay this one if i go over here and if i go to server settings then go to members so you can see there are only three members okay so now if i go and connect any of the voice channel so you will see that this soundboard option is here right so this clearly indicate that in order to enjoy the soundboard option on your discord server your server must have less than 50 people so in this situation what exactly you can do you can just kick out the member that you really don't need okay so that what is the solution as of now now in case if this is not the problem even if you have less than 50 member and still it's not showing up then what you will have to do you need to click on this user setting icon of your discord then you have to click on voice and video and here in the input and the output device make sure the right input and the output device has been selected next what you have to do you need to locate to the discord server from the left hand menu options right click on it hover up to server settings and here you will find an option of community settings click on community settings and here if you have already joined any kind of community then you will have to leave it all right in that case you have to look here a red kind of a button that will show you to leave the community so just click on it and after that restart your discord server and see that if the problem has been fixed all right now in case if this also doesn't work then what you will have to do you need to close everything right click on your windows icon then click on run and here you have to type percent app data percent again hit enter now look for the discord folder right click on it and click on delete once deleted again you have to relaunch your discord application again open your discord server and see that if the option is back now soundboard is showing up and still if not the next what you can do you can try using discord in your browser instead of the application so open discord in your browser and go to your discord server and see that if the soundboard option is coming up now all right so these are the complete solutions that you can try and these are the only solution that will be surely working for you all right so let me know in the comment section which method work for you now we will talk that how you need to use the soundboard option or discord so let me open discord again so open any of your discord server where your soundboard option is coming up okay then you have to connect to any voice channel and then here you will see the option of open soundboard so you can just click on it or you can also make a right click on it to adjust the volume of the soundboard okay then you also can click on it and it will bring up the soundboard setting where you can manually add any kind of sound that you want to get for this by default there are some sound that you can use here like the air horn or the quiet one and even to use the soundboard in a game overlay you can use this key bind so you have to click on edit key bind and this will show you the key bind control key if you want to change it you can change it from here all right so these are the quick settings that you can use for the soundboard and hopefully this video will surely help you guys and if yes do not forget to like and subscribe for any question let me know in the comment section till then take care bye bye